Where are we going today? Blue Mountain. Yes. More bamboo. Look at the little boy. Yeah. He's so cute. So we just came off a road that just didn't exist on the map, but you know, we made it to section. It never ceases to amaze me how Jamaicans will build on a steep cliffside. Like, oh, this is great real estate. It's a sheer wall. We're just gonna go ahead and put some stilts in. We're good. We're good. We got this. And boom, have like big old house. On top of your house? On a steep wall. No. Just a wall. Just a wall. Not even steep anymore. It's just a wall. That's scary. You see the mountain goat? Yeah. That's how we're going to be climbing the mountain tomorrow. Yep. Straight up. Oh. This is kind of cool, huh? Yeah. Listen. We have, we have taken a wrong turn somewhere. We don't know where the hell we are. And we're coming upon the river. Oh my god, hallelujah, hallelujah. Matt, the air is already just so amazing. It smells like Christmas trees and mint. I think I'm moving in. After that drive, we're not even, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm ready to stay here for like a month. I don't even want to go back down that hill. It's a Christmas tree farm. Yeah. How pretty is this? Yeah. Oh, there it is. Okay. These trees are magnificent. Oh. Oh wait, Kainan is here. Oh wait, Kainan! We're up in the Blue Mountains and we are surrounded by coffee plants. We're here at Whitfield Hall. I haven't been here in like so many years, 30 years. And we were greeted by the smell of freshly roasted coffee. So let's go check it out. What? This is the last batch you're done? No, I know. five or six more. Okay. I, we smell so this like all the way. Coming up, as a, yeah, like all the way down there. So, kind of not only spear fishes, the man is a roaster. So, you know, marriage material this. You can get fish and coffee. I don't think there's anything else I need in life. And that is the lucky lady over there, the recipient of all of this. Listen. Mm, mm. Major product. Like popcorn. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Mm, that smell. Oh. That smell. I'm just gonna stand downwind to this. Amazing smell. Oh, I can mm. smell it from here. Oh. Sometimes you get some earthy things in there. Mm -hmm. So satisfying that sound. This one is itching to walk, so we're walking. All right, lead me, young. Let the child lead you. Yeah, t let's let's take that path. Why? Yeah, that's what I say. Why? Oh. <laughs> I wonder. Yeah. So I can eat one of these red berries. Yeah, but don't swallow. I don't think. Okay. You can eat it, but don't swallow. So I'm gonna eat a. I'm gonna eat and chew on it. Hmm. There's your coffee bean. It has no flavor, but I'm digging the coffee beans. Let's try this again. This one's a little bit redder. Mm. Yeah, it's a little bit still, you know, tastes like shit, but it's all right. <laughs> yeah. Let me go find some like other fruit. It's like we got a bunch of onions coming up. You know, I'm in search of some kind of fruit tree that I can't read, right? You don't know. Eyes peeled. 
but I don't see anything yet. Anyways, I'm starving. I want food. Are you having some coffee? I guess I have one. He just told me he's uh, he's almost 12, so he's ready to start coffee. <laughs> oh, look who's wearing shoes. Yeah, why not? And a shirt. You're just walking through here and the smell is absolutely intense. Magnificent. Oh, I see fruit trees. <laughs> what do we have here? Oh, and they look ripe. Oh, hell yeah. I mean, oh, I see one. I see one that I'm going to snag. See? Ow, ow, it's got thorns. Oh. Ah. <laughs> sour? No, don't, don't do it here. So we've been led astray. Apparently these are very sour. No. I want to try. No. Here. Oh, juice everywhere. <laughs> it's a little sour. <laughs> now man, this will make lemonade. It's... You want some? <laughs> I would love a peach if it was ripe. Mm -hmm. I want a little hard puck peaches. You know this is where we're staying, right? You see the monk beds? Yeah. I... It looks like we got a little azalea bush. I believe. You don't see these too often in Jamaica. Ooh, but you see that flower over there? What is that? What is this bush? I don't know what this is, but this is cool. And ginger is all over the place. I hope we have a guide because I want to know the name of all these beautiful plants. Ooh, those coffee beans are like red, red. I'm going to go eat those. You're addicted to them now. Yeah. I just need food. I hear there's food and I want food. Ooh, those are mm -hmm. Yo, all this whole time I did me there Jamaica. <laughs> me now I know so we have macadamia nut. Of course, I don't, don't and know. And we have all the soccer. Okay. But you see how far me have to come? Me have to drive three hour up one rotted mountain. But I tell you what, it's gonna be worth it though. Yeah, you're going on. Look at the com comrade is already you on it. it. Oh. All right, comrade. Oh, my God. oh, look at that. Per Hold on, wait, before you pull it out. Look at what? that perfection. Oh, man. It's for you. Thank you. Oh, oh thank you. you. Thank you. I love you little prison. I love yeah. presents as food. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. You want to continue? Or yeah, bless it, bless it. Where is the, right. that it's tree? Good. I have the tree. I shall check out the main. Here. Yeah, not oh, too right. far from here. Oh. I have a That's soccer amazing. also. It's kind of minty. I had a mint in my mouth before. Dizzy, the first one you made was perfect, just for me. Thank you, darling. You're welcome. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yo, so we finally got a break in the clouds. And the view Wait, is I, magnificent! Am I ah! the S word? Yes! A very good observation, Artur. That's the Caribbean Sea. Yeah. Good job. I wouldn't have known. I smell it. You smell it? You smell that? Pretty sure that's goat shit you're smelling. Oops. Oh, now you got goat poop? No. No, what you got there? Holy Floppies? Holy S word. That's a good. I, I want to use it. I, have to. I know. Just let me use it and then you can uh, correct me. I'll add money to your uh, swear jar. You'll be rich in no time with me around. Look at the view! Okay, the GoPro is doing nothing for this view as I'm looking through it. But I can tell you it is dope. Dope! Yeah. If you're going to yeah, eat good it, luck. you're going to lose 10 years at least. 10 years? At I'd least. rather do that by drinking. No, no, without, without alcohol. No, I'd, pure, but, yeah, but I'd, natural yeah, I'd product. Can I get a high from that? Will no, I? No? no? Then I'll just go ahead and stick to alcohol. Yeah. Thank you. I don't like to lose 10 years, it's better to drink alcohol. Yeah, 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 yeah. I might as well enjoy it. <laughs> Got priorities here. Oh man, we lucked out.
I love it. We're all we're all moving to put our wet stuff by the fire. That's a good idea. It's my socks. I like this. I can get my. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mmm. It's about to get real smelly right now. Mmm. Yes. This is gonna permeate through the whole room. Yeah. Well, at least we'll have nice warm tootsies tomorrow. Good morning. I gotta tell you, man, I hate mornings. This is probably the only thing that's keeping me alive. The truth. I don't even want to go to the top anymore. And this place sucks. It's windy. It's cold. Fire is gone. I'm not feeling it. This is not my life. Can you hear the wind? Apparently we had an earthquake at 6 a.m. Dude, dude, I'm trying to find all the reasons why I don't need to hike to the top of this friggin' mountain. I can't even eat. I'm not ready. Anyway, I'm gonna try it. So I'll myself. Alright, we're up on the trail. We have walked on a walkway up. I found my senses and I decided to go on the hike. Coffee is life. So, yes, see because it. it's a whole coffee plantation. Yeah, but if we never have no coffee this morning, but now I go for the hike here. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> All right. Well, the weather is nice. Not true. Oh, look what you found. Um, this is much different than the ones down at sea level. Yeah. Why is it hold tight better? This is so much more fluffy. Look, even. It's floofy. So we're starting our journey out of Whitfield Hall. So far, total ascent, eight. So far we have a really clear day. I hope it's like that once we get up there. We decided not to do the early morning, leave at 2 a.m. Mm -mm. Me, no, not happening. I'd rather enjoy the hike all the way up and all the way down, so. Right, Lex? Yeah. We're not into the 2 a.m. hike thing. I know what a sunrise looks like, good. Gets a little no. steeper. Yes, no, we are entering Jacob Ladder. First part of the trail is uh -huh. very hard. Uh -huh. Yes, so you have to take your time to go up Jacob Ladder. All right. So and just kind of watch your pace after, right here. Yeah. This is nothing for you. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm, I've been here twice a day sometimes. Twice a day? Twice a day how, sometimes. So on an easy walk, how sometimes long it take I'm, you? 10 minutes less, two hours. Okay. I take people there that take me two and a half hours. But nobody ever ever three, beat you to it. Three hours. You never uh, bust on the journey, right? Well, um <laughs> anybody I, too I, fit? I, I tell you the truth. One time uh -huh. an Australian man tried to overwalk me. So I have to just give it to him. <laughs> and show him that this is my place. A your place this. Watch our tour. Guy kicks ass. Yo, Jacob's ladder. It's a killer. It's a killer. This one surviving. Our tour done, dust way and gone. It's alright. We're in a rush. I take with time. That mountain there. To the right peak. So that's where we're going. To the right peak. Yeah, you're going to go. Peak is right up there. Got a ways to go. We stopped for another little quick, quick break. Mr. Well, Hopton say we are very close to Portland Gap. Close to Portland Gap. Yeah, man. We're like he said that what's more important than the sunrise, because obviously we're not waking up for the sunrise, is to just get to the peak. Just making it is what's important. So. Slow and steady. There's a hummingbird? Yeah. Oh, I do see. Hello, little beauty. I doubt that the GoPro is going to see that. There's a cute little hummingbird. I'll try and zoom in. So far, almost an hour, two miles, 
and we've ascended a thousand and seventy feet. So on the go. And we made it to Portland Gap. So we are leaving Portland Gap. We're back on the trail. Took a quick little five minute stop for photos, of course. And we're back on it. Feeling better, Lex? Yes. Yes, we are energized on it. Let me tell you, the temperature changed like that quick. We literally got over that. The misty mist starts rolling in and it got cold. So I'm back in my jacket. Anyway, it's so beautiful, man. The ferns. <sighs> Check this out. So pretty. Beautiful. Oh, look at the look at the moss on that one. <sighs> man, this is so nice. the sun We've got a gap in the clouds and the sun's coming out so I'm gonna try and zoom in on this bird I took a photo of him but that's the Jamaican toady they're endemic to Jamaica and I've been dying to see one of these little cutie muffins for I don't know 10 years that you know since the first time I oh and then he flew off <laughs> They're cute. They also call them the Rasta bird. They are green and yellow and then red. They're just yeah. the cutest little things ever. So there's a bunch of them up here. So we'll try and get a close-up shot of one. Hey little toady. I'm gonna try and get closer, okay? Oh wow, that's a nice one. Let me see if I can sneak up. Hey, Dr. Bird. Hi. Oh, oh yeah, he's so. Oh, they're totally posing. Ooh, strawberries. Oh, look, Lex. Look, there's a little oh, strawberry. There is. There's strawberries here. There are actually strawberries here. Yeah. And look what we have up here. Friggin mask. <gasps> they made this sign just for Lex. <laughs> Lex, that sign is just for you. What? <laughs> nice narrow trail here. 10, 15 minutes he said away from Lazy Man Peak. And then from there another 15 minutes to the top. So yeah, we're probably about 30 minutes out. Yeah, not so much. I'm sure it's beautiful though. So we made it to Lazy Man Peak and the view is not so much. We've got the mist rolling in, got the fog, clouds. Really cool though. Are here, we yeah, made it. Yeah, 
here. <sighs> Bienvenido. Look at the view. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. Oh, there is. Yeah. Where's the big triangle thing? Well, we finally caught up with our tour. He made it about an hour before we did, as I figured. But anyways, what's important is that we all made it. Uh, right here is the highest point. Here we are. This is it. We came and we conquered this mountain very slowly, very slowly, but we conquered it. This guy, let me tell you, I want to be like our tour when I grow up. He hauled ass up here. Would you? We made it up in three and a half hours, and he did it in two and a half hours. Fucking incredible. Three and a half hours is the right. It's the normal speed. So, so what Mr. Hopeton is saying is that me and Lex are average, yeah, man, yeah. and our tour is a little bit above average. But according to our tour, we're still weak with chicken balls. You know, can't please everybody. <laughs> hey, you don't know, sir. This did have to come on the journey with me. Plus, it kind of chilly, so you know, if I take the chill off, that's my reason and excuse. I was ready for some whites, some natural whites. <laughs> that's how we drink rum. Those who didn't make it. No, usually I have ice, but it's cold enough up here, so. You're a thing now. I feel warm already. The last time I was up here, when I was a little youth, they, uh, we came in, I don't know, it must have been springtime, and they had this fruit, we call them cheese berries. They look like golden raspberries. That's probably exactly what they are. And I can still remember the taste from when I was like, I don't know, eight years old. But this is the bush. It's full of thorns. Can you see them? Kiss me rotted. But yeah, we're a little bit too early. No berries on this one. Plus we're a little too high up right now. So anyways, hopefully we'll see some on the trail going down. Look at, look at the misty mountain. Well, we didn't get a view. And I couldn't fly my drone, it's just too, what's the point? I would just be flying it into the mist, which would kind of be cool, but eh, meh. Why? I'm just, yeah, why bother? So we'll just have to come back on another day. Hopefully it'll be clear for us, maybe closer to summertime. But man, it was an awesome, awesome hike. Great journey. I recommend this fully. Going down is a lot faster. Although we got to take our time. It started raining, so it's a little bit moisties everywhere. And uh, yeah, our tour, our tour decided to stay with us. As he said, this is when things can get dicey. Are you about to run into me? You run ahead? Yeah. All right, go for it. You see my boy full of energy now? You don't want to see him when in the Pan Jacob's ladder. Man, pop down. Watch him. All I sing. <laughs> well, it's real raining right now. Yeah, we're getting soaked on the way down, but we're, we're moving on a good, good safe clip. This is my favorite part of the hike on the way up. It looks a little different now. It's a little bit wet. I still like it. You want to go to back there? No! <laughs> I think he's had enough. It's alright, we're almost at the station. And it's not much farther from there.
these are cheese berries. I am obviously too early. Oh well. And look at that. The mountain gods just favored me and I found a couple of cheese berries. I am so stoked. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna save these for Alex. Huh, they've all left me. I stopped and took a couple shots of that epic view back there. And that's what happens when you stop and relax. Yeah, we're walking down. It's cold, it's wet. But look, I was rewarded with some cheeseberries. I haven't had this in 30 years. I'm so excited. You have no idea. You know, I'm off my belly already. I believe we totally missed this on the way up. Look at all the cheeseberries here. <laughs> oh. These two, I believe, are even more miserable than we are. Oh, oh no, there's two more. Oh, one more. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys. You're missing an ear. Oh, that's yeah, poor baby. Oh, there's one more. We're pretty sure that Mama Earth is just teaching us a lesson because we didn't want to go and take a freezing cold shower last night. So, you know, she's just making up for it right now. Well, folks, we are almost back at Whitfield Hall. Thanks for watching another entry in the rainy rum diaries. I mean, you know, salt or whatever. It, it rained on us. Almost the entire way down. We are soaked to the bone. Can't wait to change. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you on the next one. What's up, Lee? How was it, man? I mean, it was pretty wet, you know, and uh, also. What's your man? Manuel Sook. How was it? Nice, nice, man. It's beautiful. For hot tea with... <laughs> yeah, fire. Where's the fire, man? The fire, where's I will literally stand in that fire. Meanwhile, I was here nice and too. Yes, I nice. can't stand him. <laughs> I'm getting right back in my pajamas and going back into bed. <laughs>